What's up guys, Asia back with another video. This video is going to be a little different than my last couple of videos because it is a Pretty Little Thing try on haul. So I got a couple of things from Pretty Little Thing and I was gifted a couple of things from Pretty Little Things. I wanted to try them on for you guys, let you guys know if I like them, if I don't. You know, shopping online can be a little tricky because you see stuff on the models and the models look amazing. Then you get it and you're like, well, it doesn't fit how the model has it or it's not the same material or or it's not the material I thought it was. So online shopping can be a little tricky. So I just wanted to try these on for you guys. I just wanted to let you guys kind of see like what it looks like on me and tell you guys what I do and don't like. But before I jump into the video, I want to thank you guys for coming back. Thank you for liking, sharing, and subscribing to my channel, hitting the little bell so that you don't miss any of my videos. I thank you guys again for coming back to my channel and let's jump into it. All right, guys, so number one, the Over It t-shirt. This t-shirt I actually found over on the plus side of Pretty Little Things, and I thought it was so cute because it's pink and it's bright and it says Over It, which I know most of y'all are over it with this quarantine, right? Because I know I am. So for me, I like my shirts to be a little loose, especially my t-shirts. Um, that's just kind of my personal preference. And I felt like this was gonna be a cute lounge around t-shirt, like, you know, with some jean shorts, with some jeans, you're just running errands, you're hanging out around the house, you're just just living. So this shirt I felt like would be perfect for that. You know, no no pressure with it. It's just really a basic t-shirt. It has a dynamic phrase on it because we are over it. So that was one of the first things that I got from Pretty Little Thing. Um, again, it's very lightweight. It is cotton material, but it's really, really soft. And it just kind of fits very, very nicely. As you can see, it's about my hips here. So I just felt like it was gonna be perfect just for, you know, lounging around, hanging out again and running errands. So that is why I got this. And let me say, I am not disappointed. All right, guys, next purchase is this knitted cover up. So I really love this. This actually was going to be for a vacation I had planned before all this quarantine was going on. But nonetheless, I'm here and I'm in it and it is fabulous. Very lightweight even for it to be knit. I picked this because I didn't really have anything in this color and I felt like this would be perfect just as like a throw on, you know, you're heading down to the beach, you want to throw something light on or you're on like a yacht or you're on a boat and you just want to throw something on that's easy to take on and take off. It hits about the thigh area, which is another perfect thing. So you're not feeling like you're restricted, especially if you're going somewhere that was super, super hot. You don't want to feel restricted. Also for it to be knit, it actually is very, very breathable. So you can feel air coming through it to your body. So it does not make you hot, which is really good, especially for knit. I am definitely loving it. Definitely happy with it. I think it is great. All right, guys, the next one is this all white linen beach set. Now, if you guys know Pretty Little Thing, you know that some of their items come with this. Can't cut it off until you decide if you want it or not. So that's why it's there, just in case some of you did not know, that's what happens with this. So back to the suit. So I really like it. I love that it's, so, it's not so see-through that you, like it's see-through enough to where you can see a pattern, but it's not so see-through that you can just see everything. So really like it. It is a pants and the top. I got the top a little bit larger simply because you can tie it up and I didn't want to be restricted when I have my swimsuit on. So that is why I did get it a little loose so that I could wear it a couple of different ways. So I could have it tied up. I could just let it flow, but I definitely love the suit look. It again is very lightweight like the other cover up. So it is not something that will make you really hot when you wear it. And when you're out, you can be cute. So you can dress this up. You can dress this down. Let's say you're at a resort and you're getting ready to go to dinner, you can wear this if you desire to, um, because it is not see-through enough to where they would think, oh my gosh, it's a swimsuit cover-up. It's actually kind of versatile. So that is one of the reasons why I picked it out when I was on the website. I'm very pleased with it. I think it's very cute. Again, I did get it a little bigger just because, you know, I wanted to be able to tie it up when I wanted to. And I like things a little bit bigger, especially if I'm hot 
Like I don't want to be like tied down and restricted and just like, oh my gosh, like be able to breathe. Also, we're human, so we gain a little weight, we lose a little weight. So I wanted to be able to get something that I could wear whether I gained a couple of pounds or I've lost a couple of pounds and it still looks good no matter what. It is long sleeved. I have the sleeves rolled up right now. The pants go down to my ankle. They hit a little bit lower than my ankle and they are a little bell bottom. So that's also a really good thing and a really cute thing that I liked about this suit. So very happy I got it, especially when we are able to travel again. This is something that I will be taking with me and something that I can wear several different ways. So with it, you do have to buy the top and the bottom separate. They don't come together even though they are sold as a set, but you do have to buy them separate. So anything that you see as a set, typically they have to buy them separate. Typically they don't come together as a set. With Pretty Little Things, I've noticed that they typically don't have a lot of sets. So when they are showing you a top and bottom, you do have to buy those separate. So I wanted to just put that disclaimer out there in case anybody has not bought a set from Pretty Little Things or has not shopped with Pretty Little Things. That's another thing along with this. All right, guys, next one is the Strappy Midi in Leopard. Love the Leopard. I think this is so cute. And let me just say, I'm very happy that Leopard has come back because for a minute it was going away and I had so much leopard cute stuff that I was like, oh my God, I'm not giving it away. One thing about me is if I feel like a style is going to come back, I just put it in a box or I put it in a crate and just mark it for later because it always seems to come back around. Now, this dress is very, oh, let me say, very tight. So, you know, it looks really, really good on the website you know, but also it is also probably on somebody that's a size, let's say two, but nonetheless, it's still very, very cute. It's very sleek. Um, it is cotton, I would say. Say it's like that kind of rougher cotton material. I don't know the exact material, but I know what I'm trying to say. But on the website, it did look a little bit more like sleek. It looked like it was more shiny. So, that is one kind of let down, but I think that it's very cute. I love the print, love the print, and I feel like you can do a couple of different styles with this, and you can wear it in, let's say, the summertime, springtime, or the fall, because you can cover it up, or you can just have it out like this. So I think it's very cute. It hits right below my knee, as most middies do, um, but again, I think the only letdown with this one is that I thought the material was going to be different. Also, I'd say that if chest is a little bigger, you may want to put on a strapless bra because it does come up pretty high, if you guys can see. It does come up pretty high where you won't be able to hide the bra. Now, it does have some kind of like little wiring thing in it, but if chest is a little bigger, that ain't doing nothing because it's not doing nothing for me. So, I already know I feel your pain. Just putting on a strapless bra with this so that they're sitting up and it will accentuate your waist. So that is the midi in leopard and it is strappy. I don't know if you guys kind of see, it does have long straps. So it's meant to come down to your cleavage. So definitely get that strapless bra so that they will be enhanced. Boom. All right guys, next one is the same dress, the strappy midi in lavender. Now let me say, I'm a little on the fence with this one because this has give and I don't like dresses with give. Also has like a slip thing underneath. So it's actually two materials on one dress. Love the color. I think the color is gorgeous. Like love it. But I don't know how I really feel. Number one about the side that kind of throws me off that little bunchy giving side and the two types of material on there kind of give me prom dress vibes. So don't know this may have to be one that goes back because I just, I don't really care for it. But it may be one that I may be able to work with and dress up and get kind of used to because I am really on the fence. I wouldn't give it a hard no, but I wouldn't give it a hard yes either. So we're gonna maybe work with this, see how long we have to work with it and go from there. But this is actually the exact same dress as the leopard but I was not expecting it to have that bunchy side. It's probably my fault because I don't click through all the pictures. I just look at the one picture. And if I think that one picture is cute, I'm like, oh, got it, boom, throw it in the bag. So that's probably my mistake. So jury's still out on this one. I will see 
kind of what I can do with it and I will let you guys know. Be sure to keep up with me on social media so that you can find out. All right guys, so this is the next one. It is just a simple little jumpsuit romper here. Um, like it because it does stretch out and I love the color. It is very red, very smooth. I think this would be really good for like happy hour or if you're just out kind of running errands, put on some wedges or you can even wear this out to dinner. Now, problem with it is, is that the neck part kind of has a little looseness in it and I don't like that. I feel like if something's going to go around my neck, it needs to be like choker tight. So that's probably something that I may have to take to the tailor and see if I can get it adjusted or fixed. But other than that, I think it's really cute. I really like that it gives you the illusion of a dress, but it does have the shorts under it. Perfect for the summertime. Perfect for going out with your girls. Perfect for, you know, a cute little date night perfect for the summertime. I actually have one that I got, I believe, from Forever 21 in black. So to find one that is similar to it, very, very cute. Really love it. Very, very cute. Now, this one on the other hand, same thing. Has a little, it's actually really cute because it has a little tie around it. I got it in my normal size. And when I tell you that the button kept popping off the scare, because I was like, you know what, I don't want to damage this and not be able to return it. But this material is, has no give to it. So if you're going to get this, and the name of it is, is a white satin leopard print play suit. So if you're going to get this, I suggest getting maybe two sizes bigger, just because it has no give. It does zip up here, and it's supposed to button here. But again, if you got a little bit of extra here, or your chest is a little bit bigger, this thing going to pop open on you and you don't want to be out somewhere and it just pop open or the zipper break or something like that. So if you're going to get this, I suggest getting two sizes bigger. Now I'm not going to put it on for y'all because when I did, I was just mortified because it was like, not what I expected. Cute play suit. However, the material has no give. So you're not able to have any kinds of wiggle room like you do here. So this one will definitely be going back. All right, guys, next one is this little jumpsuit here. It was very long down to my ankle. Um, I don't even remember putting this in the cart. That's how y'all know I just be just throwing anything up in there. But I like jumpsuits because not only can you wear them, like if you're out running errands, I typically wear them when I'm doing yoga or Pilates because you don't have to worry about shirts flying over your head or your pants sliding down or anything like that. So I typically wear these when I am doing Pilates and yoga. This is another one that I would say order one size bigger than you normally do because it's very tight and it will tend to pull from here instead of pulling from your legs. So I suggest getting this in a size bigger. Other than that, I think it's very cute. Black is always my thing. And I think that I like it, but I may take it back just to order a bigger size. You never know. All right, guys, this is the boyfriend t-shirt. So just plain white. They do have it in different colors. Love boyfriend t-shirts because I love wearing tennis shoes and I can always put a bomb pair of tennis shoes with this. Really like these. I mean, you can't really go wrong with a boyfriend t-shirt um, because I mean, it's so versatile and I mean, it's very, very simple. It's just an oversized t-shirt that you wear as a dress. Really like it and you can never go wrong with it. The reason I got another one was because the other one I have um, is more like winter time. So it's a little thicker, heavier material. So I was like, let me get one for the summertime that I can just throw on, especially when it's blazing hot and you don't want to wear clothes. This is perfect. Also, if you are like on a resort or you're going to the beach or something, this is a good cover up for you. You can also just, you know, throw it on over your swimsuit and things and it works. It does the job. Again, they have these in like several different colors. I just got white just to test it out because I was like, well, if I like it in white, then I'm probably going to like it in every other color. So definitely pass the test. Boom. Cute, cute, cute. Style it up, dress it up, do it all. All right, guys, so that was all that I had from Pretty Little Thing. Again, we had some things we liked, we had some things we did not like, and we had some things that are in the middle. But I just wanted to share that with you guys, let you guys kind of see what I picked up, what was gifted to me, and if I did or did not like it. 
my last pretty little thing haul i just kind of showed you guys what i got but i did not go into detail and i did not let you guys see it so i apologize for that wanting to do it a little different this time so i hope you guys enjoyed it if you guys have any questions or comments please leave me a message down below you can find me on social media that is asia ray cosmetics you can shoot me an email to asiaraycosmetics at gmail.com. And until next time, guys, I will talk to you later. Peace.